Potato Gators. Today, Mama and I are doing a DIY science experiment with slime. I'm going to need baking soda, contact solution, glue, and water. There they are. I'll be right back, Shug. Okay, Mama. Ah, I just can't wait anymore. Let's start mixing. I'm not sure how much we need, but here goes nothing. Ah! Oh no, it went everywhere. Gus, are you making a mess in there? Oh, rat. Give me that yummy gummy. I'm Gus the Gummy Gator. Oh my gators, what a mess. Little gators, what should I do? Clean up, clean up. Yeah, Gus, it's one of the healthy habits. Oh, you're right. Cleaning up is a healthy habit. And Mama would think so too. <laughs> Ta-da! There we go, little gators. Cleaner than before we started. Oh, <laughs> I found this lime recipe. Okay, Shook, let's get started. You can use that measuring cup right in front of you. Good idea, Mama, thank you. Step one, mix one teaspoon of baking soda into half a cup of water. Stir until dissolved. What does dissolve mean, little gators? It means the solid mixes into the liquid, forming a solution. Wow, little gators. Y'all are super smart. Let's stir it up, little gators. Agitate, agitate. Looks like all the baking soda is dissolved. Now we have the first part of our slime solution. Next, we take half a cup of glue and mix it into our baking soda solution. And finally, add one tablespoon of contact solution. Oh, I'm going to add some food coloring to my slime. One. Two, three, four, five! Stir, stir, stir! Wow, this is getting kind of difficult. Ugh. Wow, little gators. The slime reminds me of lava! Oh, I've always wanted to make a lava lamp. But I don't know how to make a lava lamp. That silly dad of yours knows how. You can ask him. Awesome! Thanks, Mama! Dad! 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 Yeah, Sport. What's going on? Do you know how to make a lava lamp? Well, back in my day, lava lamps were all the rage. Actually, I have a homemade lava lamp procedure that you can borrow. Let me check for it. Ah, here you go, Gus. I was sitting on it this whole time. Uh, thanks, Dad. Mama! Hey, Shook. I'm right over here. Why don't you read out the ingredients, and I'll get them for you. Okay, all we need is water, vegetable oil, an Alka-Seltzer tablet, food coloring, and glitter. It says to add a couple drops of food coloring and a couple pinches of glitter to a cup of water. Next, add a cup of vegetable oil to the water solution. There we go. Whoa! See how the vegetable oil stays separate from the water? Oh, I learned about this in science class last year. The density or collection of water molecules is heavier than the density of the oil molecules. So, the oil floats on top. Next, it says to add an Alka-Seltzer tablet, crushed. Whoa, it's bubbling, just like a lava lamp! Oh no, the volcano is exploding with lava! Yes, I have a surprise for you in the backyard. Come outside, Shook. Oh, a surprise? What could it be? No! Ah! Holy crocomoly! That volcano is almost bigger than me! <laughs> the ingredients are on the table. Don't forget to measure correctly, Shug. Thanks, Mama! Oh, cool! Mama even printed out the procedure. It says to pour one cup of baking soda 
into the volcano. There we go. That's done. Then add a couple drops of red food coloring to one cup of vinegar. That's it. Final step is to pour the vinegar into the volcano and have fun. Wow, that's so cool. I guess I might have measured that one wrong, Shug. <laughs> Woohoo! That was the best experiment of the day! First, we made slime. Mama made sure I used the measuring cups to do it right. Then we made a lava lamp. My dad had the procedure that we followed, and it came out great! And finally, my favorite experiment! Mama surprised me with a giant volcano that exploded all over the backyard! Did you all have fun, little gators? Yeah. Yes! So much! It was awesome, Gus! Thank you so much for watching my DIY science experiment! You can try these at home! That's right, Chuck! But remember to always have an adult help you! I hope to see you next time! Bye!